Hey guys, welcome back to Ultima 1. I've been going between these two signposts and uh, increasing my stats. So now I have 99 agility and 99 intelligence. Hopefully that will be, well, that's the maximum you can get for those two stats. And uh, we can find the other signpost to increase the rest of our stats. And the strength stat is a little bit different. We need to go out and find a different signpost, complete the quests for the kings, and uh, they will give us extra um, strength. Uh, but the, the main quest we have here is to kill a gelatinous cube. And I've just realized I'm running a little bit low on food. Maybe we should go out and uh, find some food. Actually, let's complete this quest first of all. So we've got 645 hit points. Um, I do have uh, one ladder up. That may be enough. We're going to enter into uh, the dungeons down here. So let's, let's just have a look and see what I've got equipped. I do have the phaser equipped. Um, so that will be good. It looks like we have some secret walls. I'm not going to bother with the secret walls. Let's just get out of here. Uh, I'm going to get back on the uh, the air car here. Now see if we can find a town and uh, increase our food um, supply. Here we go. Here's a town here. So let's enter the town and go to the... Uh, let's go and grab some food over here. Now uh, we can go to the pub and see if we can get some more uh, uh, rumors as well. Let's transact. We're going to buy... Uh, we've got a little bit of coin here. Packs of 10 food cost one pence. Uh, how many dost thou wish to purchase? Uh, 200, I guess. We've got uh, 2,000 food. That's a lot of food. We've got a lot of food. Let's go to the pub as well and uh, see if we can um, get some rumors. The tavern keeper saith, here, have a cold one. Uh, no. No rumors, no rumors there. No, never mind, we're gonna get out of here. Um, do I wanna buy some more magic? Maybe a ladder up, no, I don't think we'll need it uh, right now. Uh, so let's head back out and uh, we're going to travel to the next land. I'm not gonna worry too much about completing the quests at the moment. We can actually complete the quests anywhere, uh, but to increase our stats, we do need to go to the signposts. So let's run over here, well, fly over in our little air car over to the east, to the new land, and uh, immediately we found a, another signpost. Let's go and have a look here. Uh, a sign reads, Fortes Fortuna Iduvant, the pillars of the Argonauts, you find a dagger. Um, so this uh, pillar, the pillar of the Argonauts, we, will actually give us a, a dagger. It gives you the, the worst weapon that you don't have in your inventory. Uh, now down here, there should be another... Uh, signpost and uh, this one will give us something different let's head over here and see what this signpost gives us on a pedestal these words appear my name is Ozymandias king of kings look at my works you might you mighty in despair nothing beside remains you feel oh um, okay we've gained one wisdom so from this signpost we get the wisdom Oh, I need to board here. Uh, and from the other signpost, we get weapons. So what I might do is just pause the video here. Uh, just go between these two uh, signposts, see if I can take out any enemies along the way and get a little bit more coin. We've got plenty of food, so I'll be back in a second. Okay, so I'm just coming back to this signpost for the last time, and we should have our wisdom at uh, full now 99% so let's just get off here uh, go visit the signpost once more well we gained four wisdom so now we should have a wisdom of 99 so that's pretty cool wisdom intelligence and agility uh, 99 now there are a couple of signposts to the south there's the grave of the lost souls that we need to find for is it Lord British or the other king uh, back in the land of Lord British. So let's go to the south. Here is another signpost here. Uh, let's see if this is the correct one that we're supposed to find. Uh, let's go and travel. The Grave of the Lost Soul. Thou dost gain two stamina. Fantastic. So we get stamina from the Grave of the Lost Soul. And this is what we also needed to find for one of the kings. So let's board and uh, see if there's not another signpost uh, close by. Maybe we can do the same thing again uh, and increase our stats in stamina and whatever else we have over here. Let me just have a quick run across. Yeah, here we go. Here's another signpost over here, fantastic. So this one is uh, the Eastern signpost. Go east to go east. Uh, okay, so that one is actually a proper signpost and it doesn't give us any abilities, but that's okay. We can still get a stamina from the Grave of the Lost Soul. So once more, I'll keep going backwards and forwards and um, uh, oops, see if uh, we can increase our stamina to full and then we will go back to the lands of Lord British. So, back in a second. Okay, so I've just finished leveling up 
my character here with the wisdom. So we've got uh, agility 99, stamina 99, wisdom 99, intelligence 99. So we're doing pretty well. I don't really need to worry too much about charisma. We also have all of the weapons in the game, including the blaster, uh, because one of the signposts gave us uh, the least valuable weapon and uh, we kept going back we've got them all now so what i'm going to do is just head back to the lands of lord british we're going to complete the first quest that is to kill a gelatinous cube so this is the lands of the feudal lords i'm just going to head up here and then head across to the west we should come back to the um, um the lands all being attacked by a pirate ship let's go oh a few pirate ships here let's go and take take them out uh it should give us oh if i can kill them should give us a little bit of extra gold as well. I do need to head back to the king and uh, get some more uh, spirit. Oh my goodness, we're getting, really getting really getting hammered here, aren't we? Let's go and take out these sea serpents here as well. Uh, we'll at least get a little bit more cash. Uh, there is a town there. I don't want the town. I want the uh, the castle so that we can visit the kings. Um, there's another town there. Now I'm not exactly sure where we are on the map here of the feudal lords. I'm just going to have to run around until we find the uh, the first castle. Uh, are we down the bottom? I think we, we may be on the southern end. Let's just have a quick look. There's another town there. Yeah, I think we're down the southern end of the uh, the feudal lords here. Uh, sorry, the, the lands of Lord British. Um, so let's just head up and there's a few little characters there wanting to fight. Let's just run around until we find uh, a castle. There's another town there. Aha. Uh, this is the northernmost town, I think. So let's head in um, to this castle here. Speak to the king. Uh, let's transact with him. Uh, service. Thou art on a quest for me already. Okay, this is the one, the king. Um, we need to defeat the gelatinous slime. Uh, let's transact and uh, give him pence so that we can get. Um, let's give him uh, seven hundred and two. Uh, there we go. One thousand four hundred ninety-two health points is not too shabby. Uh, there we go. Oops. Let's let's get. Oh, let's get out of here now. The other castle is down the bottom here, uh, where we left our trusty horse. So let's go and speak to Lord British. We're going to enter the castle. We have, we should have completed his quest. Um, let's go and uh, have a uh, a chat with him. Ah, Bryce, thou hast completed thy quest. For this, I will give thee seven points of strength. That's not too bad. We were on forty, so we should now be on forty-seven. Um, let's head on out of here. We're going to head into one of the dungeons. Uh, see if we can get the kill the gelatinous cube. Actually, what I wouldn't mind doing is buying some ladders. So let's go here to the magic store, um, see if we can transact and buy some ladders up. There's a couple of ladders down here. Uh, okay, let's buy a well, a couple of ladders down. Um, that should help us out. But I really want the ladders up, so maybe we'll try a different town. Uh, let's see if we can find another town. Otherwise, we'll just look for a dungeon somewhere around here. But there is another town down here, I think, somewhere. There's towns scattered all over the place. So whatever direction you go. Uh, there's a town over there, but let me just kill these, uh, these giant jellyfish. Uh, first of all, these giant squids. Get a little bit more cash, and we should have some money to uh, buy a ladder up. If they sell... Oh, there's no... They're not selling them here. Oh, that's okay. We'll find a dungeon. And uh, let's go and take out the gelatinous, um, the gelatinous cube. Actually, I could try this town over here. I think this is just a small town as well. Yeah, there's no spells here, so that's okay. I do need to make sure I remember to ready the uh, the blaster as well. Um, and I think we need to ready the weapons. Uh, sorry, ready the the spells before we can use them. But we're being, we're being attacked from all sides here. Um, let's actually ready the uh, the weapon. I'm using the. Let's go ready the blaster. That should be a little bit more powerful. There we go. We are getting some... We're getting attacked uh, from all sides here. There we go. Okay, so we're looking for a dungeon. 
Uh, that's the first castle. The, the dungeon shouldn't be too far away. There's one in the forest there. I don't want, want to go to uh, to that dungeon there. Ah, uh, here we go. This dungeon. Uh, this this dungeon will do. So let's get out. I'm going to, uh, to enter. Oh, we're being attacked uh, straight away. I'm going to attack with the blaster. I'm being attacked from the side as well. Um, and don't know where he came from, but uh, he's attacking us as well. Uh, I don't want to ready a spell. We're going to ready the uh, the ladder up spell so that I can use that quickly and uh, get out of the dungeon uh, fairly quickly if we get into trouble. Here's the uh, the ladder down. We're going to head straight down. Uh, let's go and open this for the silver. Attack the rat. Open. Oh, been attacked. My skeleton. Oh god, we're just no. <laughs> Sometimes they just line up, don't they? They just just they just line up to attack you. Can I open that, please? All right. Being attacked, being chased by a skeleton and a rat. And uh, there's another rat coming this way as well. Oh, there's a bat. A bat's just appeared. And a ranger. Another bat. Okay, let's take him out. Well, I need to find the um, uh, the stairs leading down. Oh my God! These, oh, there, there they are. There. Okay, beautiful. Right, let's head, let's head on down. Uh, there's a giant spider. Now the gelatinous. Oh, there's a gelatinous cube there. They're hard. To, they kind of look like the, the walls. A quest has been completed. So let's take out the snake. I may as well kill a few creatures along the way because it will um, increase my experience. We are now actually level three, which is fantastic. Uh, let's go and kill that snake there as well. We're gonna head up. I'm just gonna walk my way out rather than using the spells. Uh, maybe I can kill a few creatures. Where am I being attacked from? Uh, there's another ranger over there. Oh, another rat as well. Okay. Um, hopefully this will give us a lot of experience points when we uh, head out of this dungeon. I do want to unlock that chest. Being attacked by a rat, a ranger, another rat. There's a lot of creatures here. They're just all over the place, so many of them. Well, that's the, the ladder leading down. So I think I went the wrong. I managed to do a bit of a circle and come back uh, the way I was headed. But we. Oh, here it is. Here. All right. Let's head on up. Uh, back up to level one. And oh, he just appeared out of nowhere. There should be a ladder leading up here. Okay. So we've got 1,170 hit points. Back up to 1,904. Let's uh, board the aircraft. Here we're being attacked by this uh, this warlock here. Let's go and take him out. Uh, there's a golem over here as well. Uh, then we should be able to go to the second castle and complete the first quest, which was to kill a gelatinous cube. Uh, let's enter the castle. Uh, let's go. There we go. Oh, let's go and uh, uh, speak to the king. Ah, Bryce, thou hast completed thy quest. For this I shall tell thee that it requires all four gems to launch a time machine. The king gives you the a uh, gives thee a red gem. So we have uh, the first gem. We do need to find four gems, and uh, we're going to get the rest of the gems by completing the rest of the main quest. So that's pretty much it for the lands of Lord British for now. Uh, we will be coming back here later once we uh, need to buy a shuttle and head off into space. But for now, I'm going to head across to the east and uh, head over to the lands of the feudal lords and uh, complete the uh, the second quest over there. Let me just take out a few of these little little characters. There we go. So I'm going to head across to the east and uh, we'll pick this up uh, when we're ready to do the second quest in the next episode. Thanks for watching. See you all again soon for Ultima 1, the first age of darkness.